Question number four of the basic exercise lesson eleven. Karen writes down six different prime numbers P Q R S T U, all less than twenty, such that P plus Q equals to R plus S equals to T plus U. What is the value of P plus Q? So let's list all the prime numbers first. You got a two, three, five, seven, eleven, thirteen, seventeen, nineteen. And um, now you have to add them together to get some result. And the first number you have to exclude, you have to uh, kick it out. Going to be number two, because number two is only pro uh, even prime number, and on number two plus all the other prime numbers give you an odd number. But um, the sum cannot be an odd number because uh, another two for the other, another two. Odd numbers they cannot add up to an odd number, so that's why you cannot have two of that list. Um, so now let's have a try. If you start with three and nineteen, you always add up uh, uh, from the smallest and the largest. So that will be twenty-two. So let's say is that pos uh, possible that you get another twenty-two? If you add five and seventeen together, it's twenty-two. Works, and then. You will find that seven plus thirteen is just uh, thirty. Uh, it's just a twenty, and you cannot get under twenty-two. That means twenty-two is not the sum. So let's try some some somewhere else. If I add three and seventeen together, that'll be twenty. Can I get another twenty? Yep, seven plus thirteen. But now you will find you cannot get uh, get another say twenty. So still doesn't work. Let me change my color. And then how about we add. Five and nineteen together. If you add five and nineteen together, that'll be twenty-four. Can I get another twenty-four? Um, yep. So seven plus seventeen is uh, twenty-four, and also you will find eleven plus thirteen is twenty-four. Then that means the sum equals to twenty-four, and p plus q is just twenty-four. So you choose D. That's the answer to this question.